Disney's three-day fan event that just wrapped up also featured a Legends Award ceremony. More than a dozen people were given the honor, including Harrison Ford, Angela Bassett, and Miley Cyrus. ABC's Rebecca Jarvis is back with more on this year's class. The grand finale at D23, the induction of a whole new group of Disney legends. Among them, Madame Leona herself, Hollywood icon, Jamie Lee Curtis. You may not believe in yourself, but I believe in you. Everybody, please put your hands together for Disney legend, Jamie Lee Curtis. Jamie Lee Curtis's pal, fellow actress Jodie Foster, presenting her the award. You are the legends, because without you, none of this is possible. How does it feel? You know, a, a little overwhelming, and for those of my friends and family who know, mommy doesn't sing. There's a great big beautiful tomorrow shining at the end of every day. So the idea that I just sang leading the crowd in a song was um, a little shocking. <laughs> we love you, we appreciate all you're doing, and we cannot wait for Freakier Friday. No, it, it, we had quite an evening the other night with, with Lindsay. It was exciting, and it just showed me exactly what I knew was the reason why I called Bob. People want this, it's the right time. Another Disney star becoming a legend. Who would have thought that a girl like me would double as a superstar? Actress and music icon Miley Cyrus, whose career took off with Disney Channel's Hannah Montana. I stand here still proud to have been Hannah Montana because she made Miley in so many ways. To quote the legend herself, this is the life. You get the best. Country music star Lainey Wilson honoring Miley with her own rendition of Best of Both Worlds from Hannah Montana. And in the world of television, Kelly Ripa, a face on ABC for 30 years. Without a doubt, all of those mornings alongside her are one of the most meaningful chapters in my life. You truly are the definition of a legend. From a galaxy far, far away. I got a bad feeling about this. To adventures around the world. Snakes. Why did it have to be snakes? With a standing ovation, Harrison Ford's films cementing his place as a Disney legend. Harrison redefined the action hero, injecting his own unique brand of humor in the character that has won the hearts of audiences for over 40 years. What you quickly learn is that the charisma you see on the screen is real, and that's just who he is. I'm really <laughs> delighted and a little bit embarrassed by this, but I'm so very grateful. Thank you very much. And think about the iconic music in those films. The man behind them, also now a Disney legend, composer John Williams. I see you. I see you. Fans can thank now Disney legend director James Cameron for introducing them to the world of Pandora with the Avatar franchise. It's our privilege as filmmakers and artists, actors, design concept artists to will these worlds of imagination in, into being. And Disney is the ultimate place in the world to do that. Imagineer Joe Rohde helping bring that world to life at Disney's Animal Kingdom. 40 years with Disney Imagineering. What's the biggest lesson you've learned along the way? You know, the biggest lesson I've learned is that you really do have to be honest with yourself, even if it's a fantasy. Something in it has to be true. And if you do that, it comes through and people feel it and it has some kind of power. And a trailblazer in the parks, Martha Blanding. Martha broke ground in that she became the first full-time black tour guide at Disneyland. Bringing the crowd to their feet as she received the highest Disney honor. My mother came to talk to me she told me never to let other people determine your future. That's your job. And I did. How did it feel to share the story that you shared tonight with the audience? I feel that I'm the example 
Don't let people tell you what your future is going to be. I am queen of the most powerful nation in the world, and my entire family is gone. All bow to the queen of Wakanda, actress Angela Bassett, now a Disney legend. From day one, in my pursuit of a career as an actress, I have understood that I am a part of something greater than myself. How does it feel to be a Disney legend? It's like a dream, a dream come true. I mean, I grew up with Disney. You are a magical performer, and so many of the roles you play are strong, strong women. And I wonder what you say to the women who are watching this, who look up to you, who want to be legends in their own right. Mm -hmm. Well, you know what? You don't feel strong every moment of every day. You know, the uh, truth is sometimes you feel, you know, really vulnerable. But in your vulnerability, there is strength because there's honesty. Be you. The world is waiting for you and that special brand of magic that you bring to the, to the moment.